Boker Tov, good morning. Continue with our three-minute daily dose of Torah. Yesterday we referenced the uh, teaching of the sages, Bikesh Yaakov Leshev B'Shalva, analyzing the opening words by Yeshev Yaakov, that Yaakov um, dwelled, um, and it's understood to mean that he just wished to be at ease. How do we understand that wishing to be at ease element? And I think it relates directly to what uh, transpires in the next verses that we uh, are relatively familiar with. Uh, namely, that Yaakov chooses to, to go out of his way and to give Yosef this coat, um, this, this katonat pasim, this coat of many colors or whatever exactly that is. Uh, and that just begins a downward spiral of Yosef's uh, relationship with his brothers as he uh, sees himself in a certain way in this family. And I would contend that the, that the, the specific uh, manifestation of, of Yaakov wishing to be at ease is a, a decision on his part that he just wasn't going to work so hard anymore to, uh, to parent his children. Admittedly, he's already an older parent, and his children are, are, have become adults themselves, witness the events that took place in, in, in the city of Shechem at the end of uh, the Parsha last week. Um, but but we all know that uh, parents are still parents for uh, the length of life. doesn't mean that they're always the ones who are um, playing the role of, of um, raising their kids anymore. But the children still look to them as the parents. And uh, to say, oh, what the hell, I'll just, this, I'll just, if I love this kid more, I favor this kid more, I'll, uh, I'm just not going to play the game anymore of, of even-handedness because I'm just, you know what, I can do what I want now at this age or I just want to be at ease. That, of course, is a terribly dangerous thing. And we know that children will always, always be looking to the parents um, and for that love and that, uh, that sense of place and the pain and hurt that will be felt by any other child if a parent shows special privilege towards one, and if indeed if that special privilege seems to reveal uh, special affection, or um, we'll leave it at that, special affection, that is tremendously dangerous. And that's the lesson we are, of course, supposed to take as we read this story. There are a lot of people to blame in, this, uh, in the events of the story of the sale of Yosef, uh, and it begins, I think, in these Midrashic words, uh, with a, a, a father who is um, just a, a human in this regard, who has let his, his, has let his guard down, as it were, because he's tired, and makes a big mistake. Let's all uh, keep, our, keep ourselves focused on, on who we are and the roles that we play for the sake of the people that we love, all of them, uh, so, that, uh, so that good things can yet be for the length of our lives on this earth. Have a great day.